How's it going everyone? Welcome back. My name is Adrian and today I'm going to be playing a game called Please Follow. Just as a heads up for anyone who maybe wants to try this game out for themselves, it does cost $2. I bought it on sale for $1, but just keep that in mind if you do decide to pick it up. Anyway, let's get into it. Let's start. I'm not even going to do any preamble other than that. Let's do it. Okay. Oh, I like the jiggliness of everything. So already it's, it's showing promise for being a game that I know I'm probably going to enjoy because I love these low poly graphics. Very nice. Anyway, let's immerse. Seems to be like a living, breathing world. Oh, that doesn't look like a good idea down there. Let's maybe avoid that for now. And then if need be, we'll come back to it. Okay, there is slight jumping. Um, Oh, what was that? All right, well, now that we have some context for what we're dealing with, a giant flesh slug, I guess it's time to go down into the deep, dark tunnel. Seems to be man-made. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Having hallucinations. Pretty normal when you start going down a tunnel with blobs of flesh. That seem to move and grow and spasm on their own. That's nice. Yep, that's what you want to see. Oh. Okay. Seems to be some kind of natural light. Bioluminescent flesh. That's nice. That's another thing you want to see. You know, I'm going to go ahead and avoid touching anything that looks suspicious or fleshy or glowy down here. It seems like this thing emits its own light as well. I almost walked directly into it. Okay, we're going down. What? The hell is going on, dude? What did it say? We'll take what you do not need. Um... Come again? A dirty drain. Plump and ripe. I don't know if that's how I would describe those things. Whatever the hell they are. Obtained shard. Okay, well, there we go. There we go. That's what's happening now. This is... This is how it's going. This is what's happening. What the hell? Let me slice you off. There you go. Oh, how nice. I got a handful of maggots. Yeah. Things are starting to make less and less sense here. Do I put it in the dirty drain? Well, the last thing that I wanted to happen is happening. Oh my god. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and keep feeding my buddy over here. He seems to be having a good time eating this stuff. I didn't know you were such a fan of maggots. Pedestal, whatever you are. Alright, well, I'm out of there. I, I think I've had enough of that. Uh... Ugh. Another drain. Oh, well, I'm gonna go ahead and... <coughs> okay! What? I didn't even read what it said, but... I don't think it's a good idea to read what it said. What about this one? <coughs> <sighs> Millions of us... What? Small ones? Something sacrifice? I don't know. But I'm gonna go ahead and take this, bring it over to this drain. I'm glad I can walk slightly faster. Plop that down on that drain. Oh! 
Okay, well, here you go. I assume you want to eat that. That seems delicious. Yummy. Yummy, yummy, yummy. A plate sensitive to weight. Is that what all of these are? Do I just got to keep grabbing these and popping these on here? Okay, I think that's what I have to do. I just have to keep grabbing these and popping them onto the thing and stuff. Boom. And then maybe I have to feed... Feed the, the thing over here, whatever. I don't even know what to call that. The sentient cauldron with teeth? That's kind of what it looks like. Maybe after I set all of these on here. I don't really like that I have to pick these things up with my bare hands. Doesn't seem, uh, doesn't seem very practical. Seems like the type of thing that could easily just latch onto my face and suck the life right out of my eyes. But here we are. This is what I'm doing. I'm appeasing the lords of giant maggots. Making an offering here at the flesh door. And then let's go ahead and feed. Maybe you need to be fed again. No? That didn't do what you wanted? Okay, maybe... What happens if I... Okay, I can't squeeze that again. And inhale the fumes of death. Maybe I'll... Boom. Boom. No, can't do it again. Maybe I'll try to feed... Can I feed this again? Hands full. Oh, I get it. Okay, well, maybe I'll try to feed this. Is that what you wanted? Maybe I only need it on certain ones. What is going on? Oh, this must be telling me which ones I have to put it on. All right, so. Got to put it on that guy, which was right here. Put it on that one, which is this. What is happening? Oh, I did it. Okay, well, here you go. You can eat that one. I'm going, oh my God. This is an insane dimension that I'm in right now. Let me inhale the fumes of you. <laughs> Crystal Spire, a stake, drive into king, pierce queen, open your mind, visions of truth. That is a series of sentences that exist now. You hungry? Go ahead and bring in one of these. I think maybe this might be what you want. Wants to be filled. Can take many. That one wants to be filled as well. Alright. This music is very ominous. Hope I'm feeding you guys the right things. Uh, let's try maybe this one. Too large, okay. Let's go ahead and need another one. Maybe I'll do one more for this guy on the right, and then I'll give you the maggots, because those seem to be a bit smaller. What is the spire over here? Oh, is this reacting to what I'm doing? The music has kind of subsided. Here you go. What's happening? Okay, well here we go. Boom, bang, bing. This is okay. This is all right. Nothing's wrong with this. 
These noises are fine. Floating right into the, the warm wormhole. You know, that actually kind of makes sense, calling it a wormhole. Can't move. It seems like I'm able to kind of move him. Oh, it's like a fever dream, man. I am very confused. I don't understand why things are the way they are here. This doesn't make much sense, but I gotta say this place is pretty nifty. Even though all those buildings look straight up flat. Is that what's happening here? Well, let me escape the confines of this. Yeah, that's as far as I can go. Oh, well. Let's go towards this thing. I want to say it's an eye, but okay. <laughs> oh, so this is, uh... This is the work of the Illuminati, I see. Oh, is that what this is? I'm in a hospital? Is this a hospital? How do we get out of here? Let me out. Please follow. Is that it? That was it? Oh. Oh, I wanted there to be more. That was so cool. Well, what the hell? I feel like there should be more. No? Maybe I'm mistaken? Wow. It did say it was about a 20 minute. Yeah. There we go. Oh, I'm upset. Well, not upset because that was really good. I very much enjoyed that experience. I just wish it were longer. I wish there was more. It did say it was about a 20 minute experience, which is roughly around where I'm at now. I'm about 16 minutes into it, but this was good. I liked it. Very, very nice. Stylistically, this is really what I enjoy when it comes to horror games. It's like the low poly kind of, you know, pixelated graphics, really grainy looking, gritty games. But even though that is the case, I gotta say, like even looking at this lighting over here, there's a lot of detail in this game. And it's just little details like this that make the game a lot more immersive and make the experience feel a lot more full, I guess. This is really good. I really liked it and I highly suggest anyone who wants to try it out to click the link. I'm gonna leave it down below in the description. Again, I paid a dollar for this. I think it's two dollars normally, but right now it is on sale for a dollar. I personally think it's very much worth it. This was really enjoyable. But anyway, that's gonna do it for me here today. Thank you all so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you hit that like button down below if you did and please feel free to leave me a comment and let me know what you thought about the video down below as well. And if you happen to enjoy and you wanna see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below as well so you can catch a new video up to five days a week thanks again for watching everyone and i can't wait to see you all in the next video take it easy